guys. Oh, you can't see me. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Let's turn light on. That's better. Hi guys, today I'm going to be vlogging, as you probably know by the title, because it says vlog, or the title will probably be Getting a Clean Bandage on my toe. Long. So yeah, I'm getting a clean bandage put on my toe. I've had that one since Thursday. It's huge! I can hardly fit it in my shoe. So yeah, it's going to be fun, isn't it? I have to walk all the way into Wakeham from here with this on in my shoe. And then, yeah, I'll probably vlog doing that as well. It'll be after school, but I'm not at school. I haven't been to school Thursday, Friday, Monday or Tuesday because that's what the doctors advised me to do. So, always do what's best for you. Oh, no, 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 no. Right, so yeah, I'm just waiting for my YouTube video to upload. I've just filmed a video. If you saw it, you saw it. If you didn't, you didn't. This video's up before this one though, obviously, so. It says in the video that there's going to be a vlog up. So I could just tell you the video now, can I? Right, the video that should have been on about a few hours. A few hours? About six. Whew! About six hours ago. Six. Is it six? No, it won't be six. About seven, eight. Nearly seven, eight. Eight hours, seven hours ago. The Try Not To Laugh video would have gone up on my main channel. So, yeah, I'll leave a link in the description to that. So you can go check it out and like it and smash the thumbs up and subscribe. So yeah, basically, that's what I'm telling you now. And I got this tripod. Ah, I just nipped myself with it. This tripod, you can just see one of the legs of it that I've just pulled up there. So that's what I'm using with my phone right now. So yeah, yeah, I'm using it with my phone because can't find the camera that I got. So yeah. So yeah, don't know. Watch me do stuff. That sounds weird. That sounds, never mind. Never mind. That sounds weird. Um, do you want to watch me make some toast? Something. Oh God. Woo! My heart skipped a beat. Because my phone just hit the little thing that comes down while you're on the stairs, you know. Hey, yo, Bella. Bella. Hello. What the? So, yeah. Let's do this. There we go, everything sorted for a cup of tea. Got the milk out, I mean, a cup of coffee. Got the milk out, got the coffee and sugar. Kettles on the boil. And you've just seen every step of how to make a coffee, apart from the last step, which is the most dangerous part of making a coffee. So, are you ready? So guys, welcome to Jake's Kitchen today. And today, we are going to be making a cup of coffee. And it's not just any old coffee, it's Cinder Toffee Coffee. Look, can you see that? Yeah. Wait. Yeah, Cinder Toffee Coffee. Actually quite nice. Coffee, but it tastes like Cinder Toffee and coffee, like mixed together. So what you do, is you just take a teaspoon, put it into that cup thing, and put it into this cup. Then what you do, Right here, open it up. Get a teaspoon and put two in, which I've already done. So I'm just going to mine it. And then, next step, get your kettle. Three, two, one, boiled. Right, so get your kettle. Now, this bit is very hot, so it's very dangerous, so be careful. Then, what you need to do is just Carefully pour the water into the cup and then stop and then 
if you have got coffee, looks like this, which you cannot see. If you cup the coffee, it looks like this, then you have done it right so far. Now, next step, get your teaspoon yet again, give it a little stir, simple as that, you can't even see it. So yeah, give it a little stir, and then what you do next, get your milk, pour it in, until the desired amount, that is how much I would like in mine, give it another stir, now throw this teaspoon into your sink, and then you're all done. Then what you need to do is you need to put your milk back in the fridge, of course, remember, you have to clean up after yourself. Because if you don't, then you're just a muck person. Is that even a word? Or oh, two words? Is that even a phrase? I don't know. But if you don't clean up after yourself, you're just mucky. So yeah, clean up after yourself. Got your coffee right here. So yeah, this is cooking with Jake. Well, it's not really cooking. Making coffee with Jake. Woo! So next, we're going to be making some toast. And in case you didn't know how to make some toast, all you need to do is get some bread. Alright, I shall leave you right there. So I'll leave you right there while I go and get some toast bread. You put bread in the toast, but not toast. You get some bread. My favourite is orange. I like orange bread. A lot. Orange bread is the best bread you can possibly get. Trust me, it is. So you just put them into the toaster like so, pull the toaster down, and then all you have to do right now is just <laughs> <laughs> Now all you have to do oh you're a bit wrong thing. No. I caught you. Now all you have to do right now is just wait until the bread is toasted, crunchy. And just mwah, bon appetit. Now what you need to do, like I say, clean up after yourself, get your bread, put it back. Just put it back where it goes. Makes things, ten, makes things ten times easier if you just do it straight after you've got it out. Because then you'll have to clean it all the way afterwards. Amy. So then, what you do, for when your toast is finished, you get it out ready so that your toast doesn't get cold once it's popped up. So you get your plate. Gently place that on the side. Gently. And get a knife, preferably one that doesn't have teeth, because they always butter better. So yeah, you get one of these. Then, you get some butter. Actually, like teleport to get my butter. Let's do what Lewis did in his vlog. Let's teleport. Three, two, one. Oh, blimey, I just teleported. Oh. So yeah, got my butter. Butter. Put it on the side. Now, if you want anything on top of your butter, or you just want butter, then just do butter. But if you want something on top, like I want peanut butter. I want peanut butter. <laughs> oh, well. I'm failing. Sorry. So, if you want... As I said, I want peanut butter on my toast. So, you get your peanut butter. Speak of the toast. We didn't speak of the toast. The toast has just popped up. So what you do once that's happened is you just grab it, put it onto your plate, grab it, then put it onto your plate, like so. and then what you do next is you have your toast here, right? So you get your butter, open it, get your knife, get some butter on the knife, and then the simple step next is just spread on the toast evenly in all four corners around every single edge. Now depending on how much butter you want, that's the thing. 
If you have a sore throat, you might not even want butter. Because dry toast is good for sore throats. But I don't have a sore throat yet. So I'm just going to think on one slice I'll have just butter. And when I have a slice of toast with just butter, I like to have quite a lot of butter on it. There we go. Perfect. Now this one I'll have the peanut butter on. So let's get rid of the excess, excess butter. Access means to go in. Right, get your peanut butter. You take the lid off. Then what you need to do, put your knife in. Get some peanut butter out. Don't let that drop on the side because that'll be more cleaning to do. Not like you have enough cleaning to do already, like, but you know. So, yeah. Then, all you do, just spread it evenly. If you have some excess peanut butter, all you do is just lick it like so. Throw the knife into the sink. Put the lid back on the... Oh, my breath. Put the lid back on the peanut butter. And put it back in the cupboard. And there you go. That is how you make toast. And coffee. Them arty shots do get those arty shots. Oh, oh, oh. So yeah. I hope you enjoyed the breakfast preparation video with Jake. Me, Jay Lango videos. J Lango vlogs and J Lango games. So yeah, if you enjoyed this cooking video, please like and subscribe. I'm joking, the video's not over yet because it's actually a vlog for when I'm going to Aiken and stuff like that. And this is already nine minutes long, but it's okay if a vlog is 12 minutes long, that's fine. Or maybe even more, then it's even better. More entertainment for you guys, even though I'm probably boring and just babbling on in the... Breathe. And just babbling on in the vlog. <laughs> you probably can't even understand what the hell I'm saying. So yeah, let me just test this coffee. Oh, look at that ripple. Oh, beautiful. Oh, absolutely gorgeous. That is beautiful. Oh, I'm gonna try pots going funny. Now, let's take a bite of the butter toast first. Mmm. You often get buttery fingers as well. But that's alright, you can just lick it off. Yeah, that is perfect. Very well done. Now let's test the peanut butter one. Hmm. The thing about peanut butter... It makes your mouth go dry. And it gets stuck up on your teeth while learning that. But it tastes nice. And it's also good for soft roots because it's like a sticky substance. So when she's swallowing it, it's like making all the bacteria stick to it and stuff like that as well. But also, because coffee has caffeine in it, caffeine dehydrating. So you could also make yourself a glass of water. That's why in movies you see people with a glass of orange juice and a cup of coffee with the toast. They're not just greedy. So look, glass of water. <sighs> Sorry for the slurping, I'll try that again. Uh, swallowed too much. Pardon me. Sorry for that kind of behaviour in the vlog. Whoa! Vlog, not vlog. I think Bella wants to say hello to some people. You want to say hello to some people? Yeah, then. Come on. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? Hello. Hello, Bella. Hello. Oh, yep, yeah, she's gone. Where you gone? A chew to you too. So, yes guys, this video has been absolutely amazing. I have taught you how to make toast and a cup of coffee and a glass of water. You will never learn this stuff anywhere else apart from on my vlogs. So, if I was you, 
Oh God, pardon me. So if I was you, I would keep up watching my vlogs, then you'll learn much more. Trust me, you will. I will see you in the next clip. Not next video, next clip. Peace for now. Hi guys, just a quick update. My Try Not To Laugh video has just uploaded. Just uploaded. Sorry about that, I just dropped my phone. Just upload, yeah, I'm not using my tripod right now, that's why it might be just a tad shaky. So yeah, as I was trying to say, before I rudely interrupted myself, my Try Not To Laugh video has just gone up. Hang on. Let's find out what time it went up because I was downstairs so we knew how to make stuff. My channel. Uh, 11 minutes ago. So yeah. Hope you... Wait. While you're watching this right now, if you have not seen the Try Not To Laugh video, go into the description below, click on that right now, watch it, and then come back to this video. Thank you. Please watch. I need all the views I can get, all the subscribers I can possibly get, and all the possible likes I can get. Because, trust me, that would be a lifesaver. Thank you. I shall see you in the next clip. Hi, guys. So, right now I'm going to get ready. I'm going to show you my magic trick. So what I do is I spin around and then my clothes magically come off and then, oh god, show any more cut. And then my clothes come on. So yeah, Batman, yeah. Nana got me these for Christmas. Yeah. So I'm going to show you this magic trick. Right. Bam. Bam, come on. But it's boiling now. So yeah, now that I'm ready, I've got my burgundy Rolf Lauren top on that I got off my Uncle Danny and Kelsey. Auntie Kelsey. Auntie Kelsey <laughs> Weird saying that. Um Yeah. I need to put my the dirty clothes that fell off me into the basket, don't I? Oh you're right there, Bella. Just stood outside the door. That's normal, completely normal. Woo! So yeah, my uh, uh, T, D, outfit of the day. Yeah. So, OOTD, like I said, burgundy Ralph Lauren top on. And then I've got my, like, grey skinny jeans on. And yeah, obviously I'm just <laughs> and some clean underwear, obviously. Oh, the coffee that we made is gorgeous, absolutely delicious. Like I said, you should make it. Now I'll try and drink it without actually slurping. That's better. I have a habit of breathing in through my mouth while I'm drinking instead of breathing in through my nose. I think that's what makes me slurp. So, yeah, I will see you people in the next clip. Hi again, guys. Told you I'd see you in the next clip. Um, I've just got back. I had my toe done. Look how much smaller that dressing is. So much smaller. I have to. I don't know why I'm telling you this, I'm just telling you just in case you wanted to know. If you don't, you can just skip ahead of the video. Um, basically, I have to redress it every two to three days, and yeah, and I can stop redressing it, I can stop dressing it every two to three days, well I can just stop dressing it altogether, once I take off two lots of dressings in a total of four to six days, and there's no gunk on it, on the actual dressing itself, so it's good, so hopefully it shouldn't be too long then. And then it go back for a checkup on the 28th of February, so last day of Feb, I think. Yeah, because last year was the leap year. So yeah, last day of Feb. So, yeah, I think this will be, this is the last clip, actually. So, yeah, I will see you again on my main channel on Saturday. Well, I'll try to do it on Saturday. If I can, I probably might be able to, might, there's, there's, there's a slight chance I won't be able to, but yeah, I will.
Well, I'll try to anyway. Right, so I'm going to film a video on Saturday. I'm going to upload it on Saturday and I shall see you on Saturday. Don't know how many to do a vlog. I keep putting the camera like close to my face. Me. Right, so I don't know when I'm next going to be seeing you in a vlog, but I just know that I'm going to be filming a video on Saturday and I'm going to upload it on Saturday. So, yeah. Peace.